Hello. How's it going? Yes, first time, yep. Indeed. Uh, it's fun. It's really, really fun. It's just also really, really hard and melts my brain. I've worked on this puzzle like three separate times now for like a cumulative total of probably close to an hour. And I still don't feel like I'm that close to actually solving it. I feel like I know what I need to do, but actually doing it is just surprisingly difficult. Well, there's a couple of layers. Because it's a duplication panel, so it's drawing the other line at the opposite in the opposite way that this one's drawing and kind of from what I've pieced together there's the repeating three drip tones there's like a there's like a low and then a high and then a middle but I only have two lows and two highs and three middles so if you reorganize it so that the sequence goes Middle, low, high, middle, low, high, middle. You can do the order of tones. And I've got pink and I've got orange. So they can't be on the same line that goes through them. That's where I'm at. So I'm trying to figure out how to draw a line that goes middle, low, high, middle, low, high in, in tone, which is the also the sizes. So like medium medium big small medium big small medium for the sizes of the uh, hexagons and yeah and that's that's where I'm at that's this is one of the few panels that I haven't solved the other thing that I can do to help you catch up is this is what my save file looks like 43867. So. And this panel is just me. Yeah, yep. I have. From what I can tell. From what I can tell. It's actually really hard to see from the boat here, but I have. I've counted it. There's 11 laser beams. I am not familiar with there any being, I, I haven't found any other potential spot where there might be another laser. So I think that's probably all of them. And um, I have actually gone and solved the final puzzles after you go down inside the mountain. And I actually, I did, I did end the game uh, by going into the little uh, Wonkavator thingy. But I obviously did not get a good ending to the game doing that. And so now I am working on <sighs> working on finding all the things I missed and solving all the hard stuff. Yep. Yep. So So yeah, it's been uh, it's been a real blast. I, I really am genuinely mystified by this. I am off this week, Luna. I am. I have the whole week off. I'm genuinely mystified by how difficult these puzzles are. So. Oh, I'm off. You are not going nuts.
I need a cookie? Only if it gives me more brain power. I I have heard that. I have heard that this. I have heard that. Yep. Yeah. So I'm I, I'm far from discouraged. In fact, I was mostly just down here poking around with it because, it seemed like an opportune time to do so. I just happened to be in the area. I was actually, I'm actually gonna just leave it because it's making me. <laughs> I can't, I don't think I can look at it for much longer without, I need to come back with a, a different, I think, perspective, a fresh, some fresh idea or approach, and the only way to do that is to go try other stuff and see what I can learn about the game. I was here in the castle, working on some of ginger snap, ginger snaps are good for the brain, the ginger probably, uh, spice things right up, am I right? My very first environment puzzle? Oh, dude. I'm gonna guess the waterfall. That may not be correct, though. But my guess is that it was the waterfall. Um... Let me climb up to the top here. I'll, like, scan the world really quick and see if that makes sense in my brain. I think it was, though. I don't think any of them had stood out as, like, obvious enough to me that that would be a mechanic until I saw the waterfall. Um, let's see. Yeah, I mean, that that is also true. It definitely blew my mind. Um, yeah, yeah, I think, it w I think it was after I had done a couple of the lasers, I did like the, I did this laser right here, the one in the forest area where the branches block the light and that's how you, you use the shadows, right? I did that laser pretty early on and I did the, the laser that's way out there, um, where you have to do the sh you have to look, you have to line the, you outline the, sh the shapes of like the rocks in the water. Um, those were cup the couple of the first lasers that I recall doing. And I think after I did them and saw where they were pointing, I found my way up the, the mountain. And then I saw that there's the little switch up there that makes the waterfall turn on. And when I looked down and saw what it did, I was like, oh, that looks like the thing that I've been doing so far all game. And then I clicked it and it worked. And I was like, oh, my goodness. So that's been that's been my experience with it so far. Oh, I forgot why I came up here. All of a sudden, there are literally puzzles everywhere. Did I do this one? I did. Okay. And I did this one. Good. So yeah, basically, I'm working on these two. That's what I was doing. Then I was like, oh, wait, there's that puzzle over there on the ship. And that puzzle over there on the ship is very difficult. I was going to make a doodle of this one. Because I feel like it will help me solve it. What is it? It's four by four. I've been drawing grids now for longer than I care to sh care to admit, and I haven't gotten any better at it either. That's the weird thing. My squares are never square. Okay, so we put the starting point here. And then the ending point here. Okay. And I don't remember what the parameters of the puzzle are, but I know that I can't draw the line through there. Um, 
and probably through there. My guess is, so my guess is if I try to draw the line through here, this will block it, but I can definitely draw it around the side here. And that's probably fine. It's just that top one, and I definitely can't use that spot either. That won't work for sure. So other than that, though, everything else looks like fair game. So I've got those two non-markers, and I'll just go take a look, see, see what we can do. I might have to take the approach of, oh, that's right, I undid this one too. Let's play first. I might have to take the approach on this one of coming at it from two directions, just like I did with this one. We'll see. Okay, so the parameters, so this is flipped upside down on this panel. And we have to do a little Tetris guy here. Well, I see how I arrived at my original solution. It's a nice, uncomplicated way of doing it. Unfortunately, nice and uncomplicated are not going to work for us in this scenario. Um, oh, no. They don't rotate? So this is... Um, This is going to be hard. Because uh, we can't use this. We can't use this. Wow. Huh. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's actually not so bad. If I just, so as long as I don't draw a line there, I can still shift the shape over. So if we just draw the line along here, and then up one. In fact, I'm surprised my old solution didn't work. If we just draw the line like this, and then down, that doesn't go through that square. And then you can just go up here and close this off. That doesn't seem... Why am I worried about that? That seems like that should work. And I... Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, that's why I'm worried about it. But I can cheat. We can start from the other way. We can start from the end and go to the beginning. It'll mess up this one, but I'm just going to reset it anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh. I, uh... I think this is okay. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Yo, J-Hit, what's up? Was it more Yakuza 7 today, my dude? Ah, uh, you might be getting an ad. I'll wait. Why am I coming in here? I need to reset this. I need to reset it. Late host didn't realize I was already streaming. Yeah, buddy. All good. What's up? Was it more? Was it more like a dragon today? 
meant to step on this. That still doesn't really help me solve. Oh, yeah, sure it does. I can go look here. Okay. Yeah, buddy. How much time have you put into that now? Do you know? Does it does it tell you on your save file? 40 hours. Wow. Chugging right along. Windmaster and I were talking about it last night. About how great the music is. And how it's like pretty refreshing from the from a series standpoint. Not to say that the music in the series has ever gotten particularly stale or anything, but you know, just one of those things where it stands out a fair bit. Uh, wait a second. Oh, but I'm not drawing over there. We're okay. We're good. I think my solution will work. You know what? To be extra safe, I'm just going to do it like this. I think there are actually two solutions to this puzzle. To get the, um... Yeah. Refreshing. That's... That's a good word. That's a super good word. I'm sure, it's food time for you, though, isn't it? Go get that food. Go live that food life. Nice. All right. I'm just going to do this one. Which. Did it happen to take the long way around? Yeah. Maybe. I mean, I guess I'd unless unless you come from this end, I don't know how else you do it without stepping on a spot that you can't use. Cause like you kind of have to you kind of have to go from here. Maybe maybe you don't, but it's a solution. I think there's multiple. You can reset the puzzle you're standing inside. Oh yeah. Yep, you totally could do that. You're right, and I didn't really consider that. Good point. Good point. Exactly. We got there. Mission accomplished. Time to draw another grid. Once I get this one done, I'll be really happy. Because this is this was I didn't expect this to take me as long as it already has. I looked at these and I was like, oh, I remember. I can just go draw those lines really quick. I'm surprised I never did before. And then I found out that all my puzzle solutions that I had already done to get through the area were not going to work for the purposes of drawing the, the environmental lines. So that was a sad discovery. And this This one is no exception. This one I honestly don't know how to fix yet. The other ones seemed pretty obvious. This one is probably going to give me some trouble. And then we can't draw a line here. Or, oof. Or through this junction. Or here. Yikes. That's. Yeah, there's like nowhere else that I can stand. That makes it worse. Okay. I This is. Honestly, that kind of sets my solution into stone a bit. Think because this puzzle has more shape drawing, but with the twist that it does doubles. Right. But they're at least spinnable, unlike the last one, which was what made me nervous about that one. So we've got. Um, 
I guess since it's flippy floppy, it doesn't matter which way I draw it. Oh wait, yes it does. Let me just spin it this way. Which doesn't really help with my terrible artistic skills, but... Okay. So this... we do over one nope I can't draw through that junction can we go up over up over and then there 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 and down then end. Oh, I think that'll actually work. We go up, over. Up, up. Over, up, and then to the end. Hey. I hadn't considered that solution previously. I think this will work for the last two lines that I need. Oh. No, it gets me one, though, which I'm going to take. How did I... Oh... This one, this one's not working. So, so there's another other solution to this that lets me draw from the other starting point. Okay. Um, yeah, because when I, I did this thing in my head where I started drawing from the bottom left and then switched to drawing from the top right, and I was like, oh, yeah, the top right makes sense. There's no interruptions there, but I forgot to draw from the the other side. Well, then I don't care. Then I can just solve it the other way. I don't care about the other side then. I could just go, um... I could just do an enclosed loop up this way, close the shape off, and end it. Wait, no, I can't, can I? Because then I, then the lines, do they? No, that works. Wait, isn't that what I already did? Oh, no, it's the opposite approach. It's, it's drawing this, it's the same shape at the end of the solution, where they meet with the tall ends to make a square in the center, but it's drawing the line the opposite way so that I can see, so that I can do the other side. Oh, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. I'm just going to cut it in here. No? Can I... Am I... Did I do it dumb? Yes. Yes, I did. So that will not work. Will not work. Bad. Um. 
If I go that way, can't hit the center. Can't hit the center. Oh, but I could do it that way. Yeah, that should work. I'm just draw it the long ways. Okay, there we go. That should do the trick. I can't believe there's there's three. There's probably even more solutions to that one panel. Makes you feel like a genius the first time you solve it, and then continues to make you feel like an even bigger genius. So this doesn't highlight, but I'm, I think if we go look at our obelisk over there, we'll find easy. We'll find that all five of the things are filled, are filled in now. Let's go take a look in a book. They're good. They're super good. Well, and the funny thing is, like, I did those after I had figured out that there were, like, lines in the environment. So the fact that I didn't even recognize to draw them as I was doing them is kind of surprising to me. Yep, there you go. One, two, three, four, five. Clean. Very, very clean. And I found that, and I found that. So what's left on this one? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight left on this one update my count castle obelisk so i've got 17 oh that's nope that's bad math i've got 15 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 i've got 15 okay uh, switch that out 15 this is where having a pencil for this would probably be smart i might update these totals or doing it digitally. Okay, so these, I'm not going to worry about those for now. I'm going to call it, I'm going to say I only have three of these in there. Three. Three starters is a bad word. Let's call it areas. And all of them are on this side. Where is this one? the ship i was afraid of that i'm looking at this uh broken line here okay well i think you know what this is probably on the ship too oh you know this oh my i think i know where this one is just based on this all right let's go to the ship again Well, we can get the one on the ship, and then the other one we have to take a boat, I'm pretty sure, to get. Oh, I got this one already, right? I kind of wish it wasn't quite as much of a pain in the butt is, as it is to get to the ship, but I'm not going to complain. It is what it is. Actually, you know what? It's right here, isn't it? I haven't done this one yet. I didn't see it before. Not quite. Uh, excuse me, chair. You are in my way. Really? It's like right where I want to be. But then when I'm on it, it's too 
the dig. I saw the sparkles. I can I can hear it starting. Do I need to be maybe higher? Oh wait, is that's the end point? Well, how the chucky darns do you do that? This chair is definitively in the way. Wait, is it part of the... No. No, that's not part of it. I might have to be in the boat for this one, too. But I don't know... Does the... I thought the boat goes on the other side of this. Wait, 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 wait. <gasps> Maybe from up a... Uh, Maybe not the stairs. Because the stairs, the trees are, like, kind of in the way. It would be right here. But we, we can get up there, too. Right? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. No, get out of the way. Oh, now it's the tree. Oh, man. Really? Okay, all right. It must be in the boat then. I'm gonna have to spend some more time in it. Um. <laughs> all right. Fair enough. No. No. Just nothing. Nothing I can do about that, man. All right. This rope. This rope that I found the one way to do. Definitely has another way to do it. Yeah, I'm almost certain. If it's not, it's the one of the biggest trolls in this game. Oh, yep. I can see it now. I couldn't see it before. I think we have to get... Up here. Oh, that's why I didn't see it. Yep, right here. Well, would you look at that? Amazing. That's so funny. I was looking at it from the other direction when I did that the first time. Well, from a different direction. Where the rope, the sagging part of the rope was like a lot more prevalent, a lot more obvious. So I didn't think that there, I didn't think that there was a spot I could stand. That's the thing about this game, though, is, like, once you really start exploring it, you start realizing all of the little ideas that this game helps you figure out, for, like, as you go, that get you better and better at solving its own unique styles of puzzles. What am I doing to myself right now? Okay. Finding... This has actually been pretty productive so far. I'm pleased with that. Uh... I guess there's a pretty nearby boat this way. And it gives me a bit of a chance to explore the fact that there are six... in here that I have not seen any of yet. I'm 
that makes me super nervous. Because these panels are kind of weird and janky. And it is not... I do not think that I am going to enjoy having to mess with stuff here. Try to keep my eyes peeled for patterns for now. Anything that looks like it might stand out as kind of a kind of a weird spot or something. The funny thing is, like, there are restrictions on like how far down you can look and how far well up is pretty. But I can't look down. I can't look down far enough to see my feet. So it makes me wonder. This green is Yeah, see this can go forward. I already did that panel. Can also go to the right. Why would I want it to go to the right? Maybe uh I looked around down here the first time I got here, and I was like, huh, this is weird. Why is this here? What purpose does it serve? And I found nothing. And now that I'm here again, I'm kind of thinking it's got to serve a purpose. Otherwise, why would it be hard to get to? And why would it be here? Okay. Yep. I see that. It's automatically adjusting my view. What? What is that? <gasps> if I... Oh, got it. Got it. Oh, that's right. It doesn't like that. I forgot. Um, I don't know if I want it. I don't know if I want it like that or like the other way. Hold on. I want it like this. Wow. Would it work the other way? Yeah, that was total luck, though. I mean, like, I... <laughs> I'm just trying to use my my intuition. You know, just trying to trying to think like Jonathan Blow wants me to think. Pretend I am him with his massive massive brain. Yeah. I think that that's kind of the 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 funny thing about this game is in my opinion I Yeah, yep. Well, and I think I made an observation that at the time I was like, I don't know if this really helps. And the more I think about it, I think it's really helpful. I was trying to put together, because the construction of these obelisks is so unique, the way they've got eight sides and the way that it's the way that the environmental puzzles are enumerated, it's not just, you know, all the way down or all the way across. 
and there's like there's like a specificity to it. And what I the observation that I made that I haven't even I don't even know if it's true, but I'm getting a lot of evidence that it is, is that the side that the puzzle appears on is important because it helps guide you in the general direction that you need to look to find that puzzle. And so that's why I slowed down as I was going through this place because I was like, there are three, there are three to six puzzles in this general area that you, um, that I need to look for. So I slowed down to smell the roses a bit. I think, I think if you know that, yeah, I think, I think if you kind of put that together, what see because the other thing I will say, part of the reason why I played the game the way that I did and got an ending is because I was like, there's no way I'm going to find all of these obelisk puzzles. It's just too much. I don't, it's going to take forever with just doing it by myself. Like I, I can't, I don't. That's not going to work. And what I'm realizing now is that there are enough, like, um, there is enough information in the game to make the task less daunting than it initially appears. And I think that that's a really nice, a really nice thing to have. Like, I really, really appreciate that while these things seem like they're going to be some great challenge where it's like there's so many and look at these weird things what does that mean and all this stuff i think that the beauty of it is that they are designed still to help yeah this is the one of the ways where it comes close i agree with that i agree with that so and yeah same thing with this i was like oh right that's pointing out towards the boat i remember doing this one i remember doing this one so I think I, that one must be out in that boat area as well. And same for like this guy. This is a very recognizable pattern. And seeing the two of them right next to each other, I was like, oh, look at that. That one fits in that one. It's perfect. So there's there's some nice things about the way that these obelisks are designed that I personally, because I'm trying to do this without looking anything up, I really appreciate that. I really, really appreciate the extra... The extra attention to detail that was paid. Well, this game, this game is a masterclass in what it is like to pay attention to every single little detail, because every single little detail is important in this game. So, and once it teaches you that, I think that's when you start to get on its level. That's when you start to get on the game's level and be like, right. Every single little detail matters. Yep. And I think that's why I'm not really burnt out on it. Because I could see hitting a point where you've got a really tough puzzle. And you don't know what to do. And you get frustrated. Yep. This game utilizes the open world to a masterful level. So that's like the opening area that we started out at. I'm betting there's more. There's another spot that I was able to get to previously, and when I got there, I was like, what is this for? I don't understand. Why is this a thing? So I kind of want to get back to that. But we'll get there in our own time. Let's look at the bottom of this guy again. See, I'm seeing another orange tree. another set of orange panels and it looks like yeah I think that's gonna be I think that has the potential to be another one the only thing is I don't really know how to oh maybe this way 
This place is a bit of a maze. And it's also kind of weird because I feel like as you're doing it, the solutions kind of have you in the same spot for a long time, not really running around too much. And I think that that leads to kind of just a bit of confusion about where you're supposed to go. Especially with the fact that these panels are recombinable into different orientations. What is that little piece? I never noticed that before. So let's see. I want to go out to this. This was the spot that I was referring to. One of these is this one. Uh, oh, boy. Now I just have to... <laughs> the downside to coming back to this is remembering my solutions from a time long past. Oh, boy. There you go. See anything? Oh, just kidding. Yes, I do. Right here. What is making that? Oh, look at that. It's the tree and those those little thingamabobs right there. And yeah, the only way that you would see this spot is like from literally right here. Okay, so there's uh, there's still more we can find, but that's another one down. I want to look from a lower angle at this orange here, because I'm thinking... Oh, goodness. I'm thinking that maybe... Oh, but I would have to have it go... Hmm. The other way, I suppose. This is the most productive that I have been doing these types, doing the environmental puzzles since I decided to start doing them. Is there another turn spot? No. But I can I can mix it with this. Like this can come over and meet this one, I'm pretty sure. Was my previous exploration. Cuz that's how that's the easiest way to solve the laser in this area, I'm pretty sure. So maybe they're both off of the same the same starting point then. Oh, not this one. Maybe you can just extend the line. Oh wait, no, it wouldn't start off of that again. This is gonna be over on the other direction. That's fine. So this
Yeah, I mean... I guess that works. Where is... There it is. Do you do anything for me? You turn into a circle? Would that even look... Oh, see, you know what? know that that works it definitely looks intentional along the bottom there but it hits this spot and looks really messy and you know you can't use that ending panel so maybe well but see and that's the end right there It may have nothing to do with this, but it's it's very distinct how the orange ones look different than like these purple ones um, or any of the other ones. Let's let's move this way a little bit. Just look around. I'm curious if maybe there isn't. A more obvious one that we don't need to try to force that area into another solution that may or may not exist. What's this? tree kind of has a conspicuous looking ending. Not so much out here though. These are freaky looking trees too. Okay, I'm not I'm not calling this area done, but let's take a little bit of a break here. I'm near the boat now. I don't see any other super That is, that is worth noting. That is something. Almost certainly. I don't know what yet. That's, that stands out way too much though. And I'll be honest, I, I haven't found one in the clouds yet, but I'd honestly, I'd be disappointed if there isn't one.
why is this here? Is it in the reflections? No, I don't think so. The the coloring of the that kind of surprise. Well, actually, wait, what's? Oh, I thought I saw. All right, let's hop in the boat for a sec. I think I can get that one that is out there, maybe. Come to me, boat. This buoy has one on it. I am almost certain. Look at look at that weird line right there. Where does it start? This one's going to hurt me if I don't find it. Because this one, I feel like, is super obvious. Is the starting spot. Oh. That's so sneaky. So sneaky. I don't think there's going to be... I think that's probably the only one. I don't think there's going to be another one. I wonder if I bring the... Actually, you know what? I say that, but I'm going to do this. So, let's see. I'm right here, right? Let's go this way. Just fast is fine. I'm gonna turn us around and get the boat facing the other direction. I don't know why I did this. I can't see the bow of the boat on the side.
Yeah. I this was not as good of a plan in execution as it was in my head. Although, what's what is that going on over here now? I didn't realize we could see this from over here. Is there anything? Uh... Actually, you can see this for in a lot of different spots. Nothing. That's probably it, though. I don't think it's anything. Alright, boat. Take me on a magical journey. That buoy one was... Whew. All right, so we're going to take the inside track here and just go to there. Let's go fast. I'm at least fairly certain that through the boat here, I've got everything. Although I say that, that this... Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. So yeah, there's the shapes. How do I get to the other side? Ah, there's something. There's something that I missed, I think. get a little ways down and then turn it around go back the other direction does it take a different path on the way in Oh, yeah. Oh, my 